Understanding Photolysis of Water A Dive into Photosynthesis Hello, everyone, welcome to our channel, where we simplify complex concepts for English language learners. Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic, Photolysis of Water. This process is a cornerstone of photosynthesis, the way plants make their food using sunlight. Whether you're a student, a curious mind, or improving your scientific English, this video will shed light on this intriguing subject. Let's get started. First things first, let's break down the term photolysis of water. Photolysis is a compound word. Photo means light, and lysis means to break apart. So, Photolysis of water refers to the breaking apart of water molecules using light energy. This process is vital for plants during photosynthesis, as it produces oxygen, which is essential for life on Earth. Now, let's explore the role of water photolysis in photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is the process by which plants, algae, and some bacteria convert carbon dioxide and water into glucose and oxygen, using sunlight as energy. Photolysis of water occurs in the chloroplasts of plant cells, specifically in the thylakoid membranes. Here, sunlight splits water molecules into hydrogen ions, electrons, and oxygen. This oxygen is then released into the atmosphere, and the electrons and hydrogen ions are used to produce ATP energy and NADPH, a reducing agent, which are crucial for making glucose in later stages of photosynthesis. The photolysis of water is not just a step in photosynthesis, it's a fundamental process for life on Earth. It's responsible for the oxygen we breathe and plays a crucial role in the carbon cycle. By understanding this process, we gain insights into how plants contribute to our planet's life support system, highlighting the importance of conserving plants and natural habitats. And that wraps up our exploration of the photolysis of water. We hope this video has illuminated this essential biological process for you. Understanding such complex concepts is a great way to improve your scientific English and expand your knowledge of the natural world. Thank you for watching, and we hope to see you in our next video. Keep learning, and stay curious!